What's up guys? NBA talk with the next video of the night. Um this was very important. The Denver Nuggets defeat the New Orleans Pelicans 134 to 131. That it was a very high scoring game for sure. Uh a good scoring back and forth. Anthony Davis doing some heavy work. DeMarcus Cousins falling pursuit like he was doing some good damage to uh Justin Holiday. Or true Drew Holiday. I think that's his, his first name. Um, they battled back against the uh, Nuggets who have abundance of role players who could do some good damage. But in the end, that squeeze. That good lemon squeeze through um, to get the win. And the Nuggets got that. This was a very important game to keep themselves alive. Um, and unfortunately... With the New Orleans Pelicans and the um, Dallas Mavericks, who we already already knew, both these guys are eliminated from the playoff contention. That only leaves the Denver Nuggets. The Denver Nuggets are the only Western Conference um, guys left outside the playoff bracket. Um, they are fighting for that eighth spot with the Portland Trail Blazers losing tonight as well. Against the Utah Jazz, I believe. They they have a chance. The Nuggets have a chance. Um, they, they've been competitive. They, they never gave up. Even though they have been inconsistent always. Throughout this season. Throughout the many seasons. You know. They got to keep themselves alive. And they, they are doing that. They are very much doing that. It was a very good game for them. Very, very good game. So, Denver Nuggets win. Very high scoring. Uh, you got this boy, Murray, Jamal Murray. Uh, 16 points, 5 rebounds, 5 assists tonight. Um, Gary Harris with 23 points, 8 rebounds, 5 assists, 2 steals. Uh, Gallinari with uh, 28 points, 5 rebounds, 3 assists. Joik, um, that boy, Nikola Joik. Um, 21 points, 12 rebounds, 4 assists. Um, Wilson Chandler with 18 points, 7 rebounds, 13 points, 11 rebounds, and 3 assists from Mason Pumbley. And uh, Emmanuel Moutier with 15 points, 7 assists. As you can see, that's a whole bunch of production. Uh, this is without Roy Hibbard, without that uh, Harry Gomez brother of our New York Knicks, Harry Gomez. Uh, we didn't see Jeremy, uh, Jameer Nelson. We didn't see Beasley. We didn't see Mike Miller. Uh, we didn't see that guy, uh, Borden, too. That's a whole bunch of production. And still people who did not play tonight. That's some good stuff from the Nuggets. They got reserves. They got a bench. They got, they got depth. It's just that they don't have that guy to surround themselves with. I don't see Nikola being that guy. I think he's a definite... One of the key players in the um, in the starting lineup, he's definitely the most important player currently right now for this team. But however, I don't see him. I see him as a star or sort of star level. However, I don't see a superstar in him. I don't see any superstar within this roster, and that's what they need. They need a guy who could bring them to the promised land because they if they have a superstar. And they had this roster, playoffs, baby, playoffs for sure. So the Nuggets, they need to get something. They need to get something good, a good player, a player who can just take them to the promised land. That's all they need. Um, the Pelicans, um, Anthony Davis with 41 points, five rebounds, four block shots. DeMarcus Cousins with 30 points, 14 rebounds, nine assists. I, I kind of underrate the, uh, DeMarcus Cousins because I keep forgetting that this guy is a good passer for for a center. He's definitely a good passer. Um, and he's showing it with Anthony Davis. They're looking good together. Their production is very, very well done. Um, sometimes Anthony Davis does some things more or DeMarcus Cousins does some things more. At least Anthony Davis has help now. That way he doesn't have to do so much and get injury prone 
every time he's on the court, like, oh, God, he's down again. It's like he's been down, like, 10 times, right? Like, more than 10 times this season, and it's sad. Can't keep himself on the court. Um, Holiday with 18 points, 13 assists, 4 rebounds, of course, because Anthony Davis and DeMarcus Cousins were going all out, pretty much. And that's pretty much it. Nothing much else to say about the Pelicans. 51% from the field overall. And that's pretty much it for tonight. Um, they will face each other at the end of this week. So, one more bout. This, this will be a good ending to a series uh, if this was the last game. But they got one more. So, peace out.